What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen bringing you a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you are new here, make sure you smash the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today we are going on our first summer vacation trip. I am so excited. We are going to be renting an RV in Ultimate Driving and we are going to be going on a family road trip. So let's get the children and let's get going. Good morning you guys. How are we doing today? Guess what? Oh my word. Excuse me. Are you trying to break our TV? That is going to be coming out of your allowance. Well, guess what, you guys? We are going to be going on our first annual family RV trip. Are you guys ready? Well, I hope you're ready because we are going to be leaving right now. Let's get in the car. We're going to be stopping at Burger House for breakfast. Well, you do not need to be so upset about a game, okay? Let's get going. Come on. We got to go. We got to go. Get in the car, kids. Let's go quickly, quickly. What do you guys want to get from Burger House? Because it is going to be a very long road trip until we pick up the RV. So I am super excited. And today we are driving our fully loaded Audi Q7. This thing sounds amazing and definitely has some good punch to it. So let's get on the main highway right now. And we are going to stop at the Burger House for our fresh breakfast. Uh, you are not getting a sandwich, fries, and chicken nuggets for breakfast. You can get... A cup of orange juice and maybe some apple slices something healthy but we are not having chicken nuggets for breakfast it's literally 9 a.m. oh gosh the police are pulling over that Dodge Viper whoa look at how fast they're going they're literally going 200 miles an hour right there uh, no ice cream we are having something healthy for breakfast okay we are not speeding we are following the law everybody okay so we're going to be pulling up to the burger house in just a moment to pick up the children's breakfast and then we'll be going on the main highway to get our rv guys we rented the largest rv that was available literally has its own bathroom there's a couch there's a full kitchen and it seriously is amazing you guys all right we're pulling up to burger house drive through right now get ready to have your order ready for breakfast all right let's see here Hi there, how are we doing today? Um, can we have three kids breakfast meals please? And one large orange juice, two waffle fries, and mm, another adult breakfast sandwich please. All right, thank you very much. Let's head to the window. We gotta pick up our order here. Seems like it is pretty busy this morning. Oh my goodness. All right, we gotta wait to pay here. I believe the total was about $25. You know, the prices have gone up quite a bit here. It is getting pretty expensive, you guys. Kids, stop arguing back there or we're going to be turning around this vehicle. You understand me? Oh, thank you very much, sir. This man is paying it forward. Thank you very much. We really appreciate it. All right, let's pull up to the next window. We just paid for our order and we're going to pick it up right over here, you guys. So it is taking a little bit of time here. Oh my gosh. Did these people order the whole restaurant in front of us? I'm pretty sure they did. Let's move it. We don't have all day here. Oh gosh. We're getting out of the car. Excuse me, sir. We don't have all day here. Let's go. Move it. <laughs> Even the officer's getting angry back here. All right. Let's pick up our order right now from the window. Dude, move out of the way, please. Oh, there's our order right over there. Hi, ma'am. Thank you very much. This looks delicious. Thank you very much. Have a great day. All right, we are getting on the main highway right now, and we are going to be going to Driving Empire. Guys, here's your food. Make sure you do not spill anywhere. The vehicle was just detailed by Lincoln Lincoln Detailing, and it literally is brand new. Are you serious? You spilled french fries? Oh my word. Well, you're going to be cleaning that up at the next gas station, okay? Are you serious? Are you guys serious? You just made a mess all over our vehicle. Seriously. Oh my word. Luckily, we got the optional built-in vacuum cleaner here. We got to clean this up. We literally had to pull over the vehicle. Uh, no, officer. My children just spilled all over my brand new SUV. Oh my goodness. Well, we got to clean this up quickly, you guys. I know. Can you believe these kids? Next time they're getting nothing on the road trip snacks. 
All right, we're okay. Thank you, officer. Thank you very much. All right, we're getting back on the road right now. We literally had to pull over immediately due to these kids spilling everywhere. But we have a few more hours until we are at the RV rental shop and we'll be picking it up very soon. Do not throw your garbage out the window. Are you crazy, you guys? Oh my gosh, cannot take these children to nowhere. So we are roaring down the road right now and we will be arriving to pick up our RV very soon. All right, we finally arrived here in Ultimate Driving. We have our giant RV. The children are in the back. There's literally so many couches in this RV. It's literally like a house on wheels. So we are roaring down the road right now. We are going to be taking a tour of the mountains, exploring the town, and this is going to be the best family vacation ever. I am so excited. You know, we have not been able to go on a family trip in so long, so this is seriously going to be the best one ever. Oh my goodness, we are following our tour guide right now. We are going up Mount Aslan Park Summit Trail. Hopefully we can make it up here. Oh gosh. Um, I don't know if our RV is going to make it up here, you guys. We might have to get some more torque. Let me back it up. The children in the back of the RV right now. How you guys doing back there? Let me get some speed here. We're going to make it up here, okay? We're going to try. Hopefully we can make it up here. I don't know if we can, though. Okay, we, we're punching it. We're punching it. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Guys, we got it. We got it. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, we're trying our best here. Oh my gosh. There we go. There we go. We got it. We got it. We are roaring up the hill slowly but surely. This thing is bogging pretty bad here. Oh my goodness, you guys. Oh my goodness, guys. I don't know if we're going to be able to make it up here. Uh, tour guide. We're trying our best here. This is not going so good. Um, the RV is literally getting stuck on this hill. Oh my goodness, we're using the air ride suspension on this thing. It Okay, let's back it up. We're backing it up again. Okay, we need to get a lot of power here. Oh gosh, guys, we are like... We're getting completely stuck here right now. I seriously cannot believe this is happening to us. We are trying to make it up the hill. Oh my gosh, tour guide, I think we are going to have to go somewhere else because this is not working out too good here. All right, let's get back on the main highway right now. Uh, we're going to continue exploring. Unfortunately, we are not able to make it up the mountain right now. So we're going to continue on the main highway right now. And we are going to be checking out some other places throughout the town. As you guys can see, there is a beautiful beach over there. Super, super nice. What are you guys thinking so far of the trip? I mean, the RV is pretty comfortable. There's literally two couches back here. There's literally a full-size fridge. And this is going to be the best trip ever if we can ever make it up somewhere. So we're going to take a straight road up ahead, and then we're going to be going somewhere else. Our tour guide is going to be showing us the way, so go ahead, tour guide. We'll let you go by, because we're not really familiar with the town here. Okay, I think they want us to uh, keep going down here. Let's see. We got some beautiful beaches over here. Super, super nice. But guys, what do you think so far of the trip? I mean... Unfortunately, we could not make it up the tallest mountain with this thing. It's got 50 horsepower. It goes a little bit too slow, so we're not able to go there. But we're going to get on the main highway right now. We're going to see where it takes us. Hopefully, we can find some other national park to go to as well. But here is a giant beach area. All right, looks like our tour guide is going to be stopping us right over here. All right, let's see what he has to say. All right, we're going to be eating here, you guys. Everyone get out of the RV here. All right, you... We're going to be eating here, everybody. All right, let's grab some food from the refrigerator from the inside of the RV. We're going to be eating our dinner here, and it is going to be amazing. We got this giant refrigerator. I know. Thank you very much, sir. Guys, we got our food here. Let's find a spot by the beach. Seriously, right over here. All right, my daughter's parking the RV for us. Thank you, sir. We got a beautiful RV. This is the fully loaded option one. Very, very nice. All right. Come on, you guys. Let's go by the ocean, enjoy our dinner, and we will relax a little bit, and then we will continue back on the main highway. We got a very nice view over here. There is like a little rocky mountain over here. I think we'll have our dinner right on top of this, so we can see the views from here, you guys. Look at this place. What do you guys think? This is super peaceful, super nice. Son, you speechless over here? Yeah, we are literally on top of the world right now. I mean, it is just so nice, so peaceful. 
So, I mean, it is very, very nice here in Driving Empire. All right, dinner was very, very good, you guys. Very good. So let's get back in the RV and let's continue exploring the town. We got a lot of exploring to do here. Come on, everybody. Oh my gosh, look at that guy. Oh my, oh my gosh. That guy literally flipped over his truck there. He's literally going like 200 miles an hour. What in the world? All right, you guys, let's get in the RV right now and let's continue on the road. Come on, everybody, let's go, let's go. Oh my gosh, son, we finally found you. Come on, you guys, get in the car, let's go quickly. We got a lot of places to go, hurry up. All right, we are gonna follow our tour guide. You got the co-pilot right next to me and we are driving on the road again. We're on the road again. Guys, what do you think so far of the trip? It's been pretty fun if you ask me. I mean, we got to explore a little bit of the mountain, although we were not able to drive all the way up there. We had a beach dinner, which was super, super nice. And the RV is seriously so much fun to drive around the town. I mean, you know, I think we need to buy one of these, you guys. They are super nice, and they literally are a house with wheels, okay, everybody? So we are going to be going down this main highway again. Our tour guide said he has something special to show us, something that not everybody is familiar with in this town. So hopefully we do enjoy the surprise that he's going to be showing us. You know, it feels like we have not been home for weeks. We've been driving, we've been eating out fast food all the time. So you guys know that feeling after vacation, you're home, relaxing, and you know, you just need to be home after some time. So we are going to be going a little bit more exploring. Hopefully we are going to be arriving here very soon. Not too sure where we're going. Our tour guide, he knows this town. He's been living here since he's been five years old. So, I mean, he knows it. Okay, we're gonna press T. All right, we got more traction now, perfect. Uh-oh, guys, I think we're going a little bit too quick there. We got a little virtual speeding ticket there. Oh my goodness, oh well. Luckily, we've been saving up for our vacation here. We are going so fast right now. Oh my goodness, this thing goes very fast. We're going like 90 miles an hour. But I think there is a little amusement park up here. You guys wanna go check that out? Or should we keep going? I don't know where the tour guide's taking us. There's an amusement park right up here. We might have to stop and check it out. Not too sure if we can actually get on. Can we get on this? I don't think it's even working. What do you guys think? Should we get on? Come on, you guys, let's go check it out. I don't know if this actually works or not, but we're gonna try it out. Okay. Guys, I don't think this is actually working. Oh, it literally goes so slow. Guys, we're gonna be on here for like 20 minutes. I don't know. You guys can go for a little spin there, but seriously, it literally goes like 0 .0001 mile per hour. Hurry up, get off there. It's gonna take you 50 years to get up there. Oh my goodness, that is literally too boring. All right, let's get back in the RV. We're gonna keep going. We wanted to stop for the amusement park. So we are getting on the road again. We got the kids. Come on, everybody, let's go. Tour guide, where are you taking us? Come on, tour guide. Let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, we're following our tour guide right now. The RV is bogging a little bit. It's going very slow. We need to put this puppy in a sport mode or something. There we go. Picking up some speed here. Must be because we're running a little bit low on fuel. But guys, here is the Pacific Oceans right next to us. How cool is that? We are driving on one of the world's longest bridges in the whole world. It is super, super cool. What do you guys think? Well, children are having fun in the back of the RV right over there. I mean, they get to relax on a couch while I have to drive this giant, giant, giant RV. I mean, this thing is literally humongous. Yeah, we are going a little bit slow. This thing is going a lot slower than usual. Not too sure. We might be having an engine malfunction or something. I mean, the engine has been bogging a little bit. It is not sounding too good. It's like huffing and puffing making it up this hill. Oh my goodness. We might have to pull over somewhere and check and see if the engine is okay, you guys, because I don't think it is. It seriously is driving horribly, and it's starting to smell like burnt oil in the compartment back here so I mean we're literally in the middle of the ocean right now so we're gonna have to pull over after this hopefully everything is okay I mean we might have to borrow our tour guide's vehicle and go with him the rest of the route because this thing is not driving good at all the engine is sputtering and it sounds like I mean 
sounds like this thing is not going to make it. So we're going to have to pull over up here once we're off this one lane highway. See what's going on with the RV. It also says that the engine is starting to overheat here. Oh my goodness, you guys. Our engine is literally starting to overheat. This is not looking too good, you guys. Oh my goodness. The engine is literally smoking. We better pull over up here, guys. This is not good. Uh-oh. This is literally a rental. Okay, we're going to have to check out the engine up here. All right. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. Um, sir, the engine is literally smoking. I mean, it is not sounding good at all. It was driving horribly and it was literally going so slow. Um, it is not too good. Not too good at all. We might have to, uh, go with you because this RV is literally broken. It's seriously, it's not running good at all. Uh, let's grab our things from the back of the RV. Luckily, this is a rental and, you know, we don't have to pay for the damages, but seriously, still, it is a lot of money. Oh my gosh. Well, we're going to have to leave it here for a tow truck. It overheated. Someone put spaghettios in the brake fluid oh my goodness no wonder the brakes were not working all right well we are going to have to leave this thing here they are going to have to fix it call a tow truck but we are going to get in our tour guide's vehicle he is going to be taking us the rest of the ride here because um our rv is literally destroyed so let's keep going here hopefully uh the tow truck will be picking up that rv soon and you know, they're going to have to pay for the damages because it is a rental vehicle. We are not responsible. It is not our vehicle. I mean, they probably did not get any maintenance done. We're going to go to the dealership and get a bigger car for us. But as you guys can see, these are the Badlands over here. I mean, it is mostly a swampy area. Super, super cool. But guys, you know, I cannot believe our RV literally broke down in the middle of our vacation. Unbelievable. I seriously cannot believe this. You know, we were supposed to continue go camping at the top of the mountain. The RV would not make it up there because it had 50 horsepower. Seriously, it was unbelievable. So we are going to be staying at one of these beach houses for a few days. And then we'll be headed back to Greenville. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. It definitely was a crazy one going on a family RV adventure. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure you guys drop a like leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to join the Wanny family today. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.